at all. 26 fights on his record, 19 victories, 7 defeats. He's from Germany, training out of Fairtex Training Center, and in his last fight, he won on points against Det Serie A, Do Pet Det One. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out the red corner, he goes by the name of Det Rit Grice here at Boxing Gym. 33 years of age, 178 centimeters tall, has a total of 111 fights, 85 victories, 24 losses, and two draws. Currently training out of Guy City Report Boxing Gym, and he is from Kargan Province. So Detrit, a wealth of experience in the stadiums on the elite circuit, and also on the entertainment shows. He possesses incredible power and does, is not afraid to use it. Winning on points in his last fight against Hassan Vadanarad from Iran. But he's going up against Aaron Bourne, who is a great up-and-comer out of the Fairtex Training Center in Patea, who's really got into a good winning streak here at LWC Super Champ, and here he is in the final. I gotta say, this is the sort of matches that I love. I mean, one fighter looking to make a name for himself, the other fighter, the old guard, the one with wealth of experience being through it all. It's just gonna be an interesting matchup. I mean, this is one way that Aaron Bourne can make a name for himself. So Aaron Bourne, 10 years the younger, four centimeters taller, but Detrit with pretty much quadruple the amount of experience and maybe even more compared to Aaron. Yeah, this is po potentially changing of the guard, Kevin. Old guard versus new guard. Can't wait for this bout to kick off and here we go. Last instructions from referee Bunlert. I think he's the only referee that we have that is taller than uh, than both of these fighters. So it is a good pairing. That's going to be handy. Very, very handy. What we know about Dedrid's style is that he does like to start off slow. I mean, in the first round, he doesn't do too much. If you want to realize, or maybe I'm just not that intertwined with Muay Thai Fimu tactics. I mean, because in the first round, you see him, he likes to touch around, not do too much perhaps block every now and then, but he doesn't take too much damage in the second round. That's when he, things really get started for Dead Rich. Whereas Aaron packs a lot of power for his size and isn't afraid to come forward and test his opponent with every weapon in his arsenal. So this is for the final of the Global House Tournament Grand Prix. The winner will receive 60,000 baht in prize money and that nice shiny belt. The runner-up will receive... 30,000 baht, but you don't, definitely don't want to be a runner-up if you've got to the final. Really excited for this matchup here. I mean, this is the matchup that we're both excited for the most in this fight card. Here we go. Round number one. Good kick there from Dead to start things off. Aaron just missing with the kick, but going back with the teep. So Aaron with a slight height advantage. Let's see if he can use it. Detrit straight away unleashing heavy artillery with his boxing combos. Good left hook so far from Detrit. From the last fight that we saw Detrit competed, I mean, he competed like he was a pro boxer instead of a Muay Thai fighter, using a lot of head movement, a lot of punches. Very, very accurate with his punches as well. Yeah, a lot of experience in multiple disciplines, Detrit. Good block of the low kick from Dead Red. Going for that right hand, and that seemed to have stunned Aaron just for a moment. And Dead Red is following up here with a left hook and pushing Aaron back now. Aaron needs to hold a high guard. Oh, he's stumbling there. Gone down for an eight count in the within the first minute of the first round. Wow, I mean, what a start there from Dead Red. Aaron already having a big mountain to climb. Dead Red going for that low kick, going for the hands once again. There he goes, unleashing here. Really low and wide guard here from Aaron on wobbly legs as Detrick pounces on him again. And he's down for a second time. Is he going to make it up? Only one more count left. Aaron Borden needs to protect himself at all costs now. Referee Boonler resuming the action. It's only a matter of time. Can Aaron Borden hold on? Detrick got to go for the kill now. Good punches, very accurate, so powerful. Budenlert looking like he's about to step in. He's having a close look. Another right hand connects there for Dedrit. Another right hand. Referee Budenlert lets the fight go on. Aaron keeping his composure. Staying strong. Staying on his feet. Another right hand connects for Dedrit. Dedrit just attacking at will. 
unleashing the power from Detrit with the clubbing overhand right and referee Brunler has seen enough Detrit is now the new Global House 154 pound Grand Prix champion I mean that was fantastic there from Detrit we know he has that experience we know about those boxing skills we know about him fighting all over the world and now he's picked up another title well done there for dead red guys here report boxing gym and he dispatched aaron bourne within the first round there's literally 54 seconds left on the clock it was just keeping it simple it was the left hook that started it and the right hand finished it for dead red a real shame for Aaron Bourne, but he's young, he's hungry, and I'm sure he will be back. And that's right, he's got a wealth of experience to train with at Fairtex Training Center. But that was just a really good display from Dead Rid Grace Report Boxing. Just keeping it simple and using heavy punches, which is exactly what you have to do against a fighter that has a height advantage over, to you, over, over you. We'll take it to Matthew Dean and see you in the main event. And ladies and gentlemen, with a fantastic performance here in the final of the Global House Grand Prix 155 pound tournament, we have a winner by way of knockout in round number one, Dave Lee Gray. Sit up, up boxing you from the red corner. Oh, it's so yard, come on, Nima, so do. โหดสุดๆนะครับผมขอบคุณแอลเลนบิออนจากเจอร์มนีด้วยครับแต่วันนี้โอ้เป็นของเดนลิทจริงๆครับมันมาแล้วฮะนักฟวยคนนี้คร